coming. Just a second. No. No what? Just no. You're not answering the phone and you won't return my messages. Look, Todd, if you're here to talk about um, what happened in the elevator, we're better off not talking about it. I disagree. I think we need to talk about it. I think if we don't talk about it, then I think we're going to lose. We'll both lose. Lose what? Us. We can't do this, Todd. Can't do what? Talk? We have to talk about it. What happened in the elevator was... The biggest mistake I've ever made in my life. <laughs> well... Okay, let's not let it come between us. You know... You know, I can count on my hand the number of people in the world who care about me. And when you found me in that elevator, you, you, you cared for me. You comforted me. I don't know how that was wrong. I mean, does it really matter? The only thing that matters to me is I don't lose the best friend I've ever had. Look, I'm, I'm not really in a very good place right now, so we better just do this another time. Well... If that's what you really want, I'll, I'll go. I will, but but don't ask me to leave because you're feeling vulnerable. Because I'm not going to hurt you. I don't think I can hurt you. I want to help you, like you've helped me so many times. I want to be your friend. Let me let me be your friend. You look like hell. Thank you. You're really helping me. Thanks. That's brutal honesty. It's my way of caring. Look, there's no way I'm pouring my heart out to you. Okay. Well, let's talk about why I'm here. What, you want to talk about what happened in the elevator? Because talking about it, that, that has done nothing but get me into trouble. Oh, no kidding. What happened? I told Christian that we kissed. And he broke my heart. Christian broke your heart, huh? And you're just trying to be honest with him. Well, that's vintage Vega, if you ask me. I mean, I assume you explain the situation to him. I realize he hates my guts, but he doesn't he doesn't trust you at all. Don't. Don't you dare try to make him the bad guy. Evangeline, he, he, Don't defend him. He's treated you like dirt. I deserve it. And how many times? How many times have I defended you? A loyalty, that's your blessing and your curse. <laughs> all I know is that I'm in love with him. And you're in love with Blair. Yeah, but the situation with Blair and me is different. I did something to Blair that she thinks is unforgivable. So we're through. But you've done nothing wrong. And he, he's, he's just going to dump you at the first sign of... Well, I'm, I'm not saying that, the, that the, what happened in the elevator was a sign of anything, but... Christian has had a problem with you and me for a long time, and you just egg him on. I don't think he you deserves do. you. You egg him on. He, he doesn't deserve you. Enjoy you enjoy making him jealous. Do I have to say it again? Christian doesn't deserve you. You're right. He deserves better. I'm not going to give up on him. I'm not giving up on Christian, and don't you give up on Blair. Ah. Blair and I are past the point of no return, though. But... I guess you could probably get back with the Mexican. He's Puerto Rican. I don't care. I don't like people. 
I hate everyone, regardless of creed or race. I especially don't like women of color. Todd, you're trying you're trying to piss me off. Oh, really? And why would I do that? Because you're trying to keep me from thinking about Christian. Don't sit on your cell phone. Is it working? You're obnoxious. And I find it charming. Oh my god, what's wrong with me? <laughs> I need to get some sleep. Okay, so, um, I know you came here to clear the air about, you know, the kiss, whatever. Consider it cleared. We are two friends, and we were comforting each other in a moment of despair, okay? But if you think you have another agenda tonight, like making me feel better about myself, then you're wasting your time. Oh, you, you, you. Everything's about you, isn't it? What about me? What are you going to do to make me feel better? This movie? This is your idea of cheering me up? I'm cheering me up. I'm going to watch a movie about two people whose lives are more screwed up than mine by myself. Oh, but it's a, it's a chick flick. It's a slower fest. Here, give me that. I bet there's something on the Slasher channel. Yeah, and I'm sure it's playing on the flat screen at the penthouse. The guests get to pick the program. No, you can't get... You're not a guest. Give me the remote control. What remote control? The one that's... Give it... Well, just turn the knob. I'm not playing with you, Todd. I'm not playing with you. Freaking... I don't have a remote Give me control. the remote control. With this one? Yes. There it is. Just... Get it. I'm not... Get it. You're right. Come on. Oh, yeah, yeah. Come on. on the next One Life to Live. I have to question you on suspicion of Truman's murder. Did she go? Yeah, I should. It smells like... Smoke. I love you. I love you, too. Watch weekdays on ABC. Weeknights on SoapNet.